streamed in a while. My apologies. I've been busy. I work at Sheridan now. I have work. That's why I have not been streaming. Now, as the title suggests, I have ordered a figure. So the title is the name of the figure. Um, I paid for this figure uh, $621.11 Canadian. And we're going to be unboxing it today. Robin's going to get the case for it. Hello, everybody. I know it's been a while. Excuse me while I get my camera situated. It's a box inside a box. It's a box inside a box. So exciting. All right. So here's that. If somebody wants to take my phone so I can slip this or, out. Or, or, you know, let your sister help you. Someone can slip that out because I cannot, because I am holding a phone. Alright. Here is the box. It's completely undamaged. This is the company that makes it. It's an E-Stream figure. This is the highest quality company that you can go with. Alter is another one. Um, but E-Stream is uh, the one that is the most expensive. I've seen some of their figures. This was my first figure from them. Now the box. A box inside a box. Which, by the way. Oh, look at the front. Oh my God, she's gorgeous. Yo, let's get I, her out of the packaging. I haven't even seen this thing yet. I'm kind of looking at the back. I'm scared of Robin with the knife, personally. Maybe. I'm gonna get stabbed, bro. Alright. Now we're opening her. So much tape! So much plastic! So much waste! All right. I want these boxes. Alright. Okay, I'm gonna lay her down flat. Oh my god, she is gorgeous, guys. Look at that. Holy shit. Watch your language. I can swear on this. Everybody knows Damn. that. Where's Damn. the knife gone? Behind you. Thank you. On AFK. Why don't you have it literally set up like this? With the board in the back. Oh my god. Okay, Sierra. And then there's more tape here in the back. Is there? Yeah, I can you. Oh wait, you're excited. Oh my gosh. She's beautiful. Yo, worth every friggin' dollar I spent on her. At least she's not a one-piece figure, which is good. Did she come with instructions? No. No. Alright, I'm going to put you guys there as I situate myself.
Here, see her. Put her here. There's her base. Oh, wow. Oh, Flaky's back. Flaky. Look at the size of this thing. Flaky. Look at the size of this thing. It comes with wings that makes it even bigger. Alright. Like, you want me- oh. Ah, uh, yes. No. I shall turn the camera. Come on. Here we go. Isn't this like your biggest right here? Yeah, yes. Okay, there's three, there's three, uh, feathers here. I don't know where they'll go. Eh. We'll see it in a minute. Ayazawa just fell. As a committed jump. Along with Deku and Bakugo. They all committed jump? Yes. Okay. I think Bakugo blew Deku up and Ayazawa tried to stop him getting a little bit of explosion. <laughs> the Clearly. Feathers. His and Midoriya's arm fell don't off. He broke know it again. Where they go. Pop this is a rock. Someone's going to have to look up on uh, their Can phone what, where everything goes. This is a rock, it's flat. Uh, what, what's it called? Brilliant Alice? Yep. Why don't you put it down here already? Yes, I have a charging bank on it. Uh, yeah, you need a new charging bank because this thing's going to blow up on you. Because uh, it's completely... How does that go in? There, there's the full yeah. figure. Yeah, if you can show me. The feathers are supposed to go at the bottom. The rock's supposed to go at the bottom. And the thing's supposed to go in her hand. So this is all supposed to just kind of like fly. Yeah, it's just supposed to go like that. These are supposed to just kind of float there, sit there, and this is supposed to be like here. If you want to sit her down. I would do this on a flat surface, personally. Can someone please keep a level? Welcome to... Do you have both feathers? I have one. There's one right in front of me. She in? Yep. Okay. Flat line. The rock goes over here on that. Then the feathers just plop them. However you lay them. Okay. With the base. In which case, watch your steps here. Let me just put her like this. Yep. What I'm trying to do. All right. Let me clean them. Alright. I have a whole anime shrine. I do. I really do. I will sh give you a quick room update. But I wanted to get an unboxing for this. Babe. Babe, look at this. The, this camera doesn't even give it real justice. That is a $621.11 figure for you. And it, she is beautiful. Alright, do you want to put her... I have to wait for your butt to move. <laughs> that looks ama literally amazing, Jesus. I know. She's gorgeous. And as for everything else, here is a r room update for you guys. I have all my anime swords. I've got a custom 3D print sword of kits. I have... I don't understand why she has to get waifus in one container. More anime here. 
all the anime here, all the anime and over anime. there, more over there, and then I have some downstairs with on my desk as well. Here is it with the light, so it looks a little bit nicer. But yeah, that that's my uh, my shrine for anime and weeb stuff. I have this room is absurdly expensive and do, do not, not do not take what I do and do it yourselves unless you are financially sound in which case then go for it. No, no, you she need not to financially sound. I'm not financially sound. So don't listen to her. Don't do this. <laughs> Most of this shit's mine, so well, Robin both is of also ours. not Mother Robin is also not financially sound. Don't do this. Hey, I don't buy as much as she does. I don't spend 500 bucks on one. Please. This is my one, this is that one off type of thing. Um, you know, until she gets the rem. Until, like, no, so put in perspective, there's another figure similar to that, but it's crystal rem, but it's demon rem. And that figure is 400, over $400. Well, that one was $300 originally, which then became 621 11 so put in a perspective for you, four hundred dollar figure that's gonna be coming out to like eight hundred dollars. Now that ruler's so, out of her box, can I borrow her for like ten seconds? If that's possible. Can I borrow her for ten seconds while I go see if this is the size? Of Anyways, the I will show you. So the. Uh, rider figure in the back that's a bikini um that's an altar figure and that's another really high quality um company there's a jean d'arc altar figure that's six hundred dollars canadian um that's also pretty what is that one seventh scale Yes, anime figures are extremely expensive. You've got to pick and choose your battles. If, For my suggestion, if you are going to buy anime figures and you're really into the passion, um, do, research. do research. Find good deals for them. Um, she Ami, saved up all of her points. Uh, I saved up my points and I had like over a thousand points to specifically buy... Um, this figure that I just was showing you, okay. um, uh, specifically. Yeah, this is a seven inch, right? Yeah. This is a seven inch. Yep. So this is the size I need for. Um, but overall, oh, basically, um, my recommendation if you're gonna buy anime figures, um, Ami Ami is good. It has a pre-owned section. That in the pre-owned section, you are able I'm to find scale figures like, that are more. Uh, Cost efficient. Cost efficient. My yeah. one thing about the shipping fees is if you ship with DHL, as much as it comes faster to you, uh, it is more costly to ship with DHL, as you get uh, import taxes on top of that. Well, if you go through a small package, it's let you only pay your direct shipping, and you don't pay any extra shipping costs. Whereas DHL, you do. So, that's my suggestions for that. Uh, overall, just be cautious on what you're doing. Uh, Amazon's okay, but um, if you're really going to be looking at getting, like, scale to scale figures, which are uh, like that Alice, like some of the other ones I have that are more expensive, uh... My suggestion is buy them on Ami Ami. If you, as long as your card allows you to use the ability to uh, change um, your credit card from uh, Canadian funds or American funds or whatever funds you're using to um, yen. yen. Um, but that's kind of my broad general scope of kind of anime collecting. 
Mother Oven's always the one stuck cleaning everything. I am finishing up my video. But, um, yeah. Anyways, guys, that's about it overall. Uh, I am gonna be, I am working on a video currently for Dream SMP for the Mask AU. Um, so that'll be coming out in a little bit. Um, I want to ask, do you order from eBay? So, in terms of eBay, where? Where? Where, Robin? Hanging right here. Hold on. It's dead. You're fine. All right. I had to kill a spider. I'm sorry. So, for the term of uh, ordering from eBay for it, so or I have ordered from eBay before. Um, in terms of eBay, yes, you'll have to pay an extra tax on eBay, especially if you're um, getting it to come into another country like Canada. Um, you have to pay the Im import taxes for that. Um, the same is with DHL. Uh, Amazon is not. Amazon, you pay direct charges and um, it's fine. Uh, in terms of eBay, yes, you do pay when it arrives and or you pay online for it. Um... And stuff like that but yeah that's kind of like my stuff so Amazon is one direct payment eBay is two uh, and Ami Ami is two um, those are the places that I've personally gotten my figures from that I have also gotten my figures from my local anime shops which are labyrinth and um, anime extreme those two are um, those two are specifically, um, stuff that are, um, for that. So, those are the places. So, I've gotten Ami Ami, Amazon, Labyrinth, and eBay. Those are your, my four that I've used. So, overall, that is kind of how that situates, um... Oh, cool! You're getting the Sunset and Rainbow Fashion Squad set. That's amazing. There, I, uh, I have seen those available on Ami Ami as well, um, and I'm interested in getting them as pre-owns eventually. Anyways, guys, that's about it for me today. I'll do one more look around my room for you guys to see everything. I have an entirely themed anime room. But anyways, guys, that's my room. It's too much money that I have put into this. Mm -hmm. My girlfriend does not want me to say how much because then I'm only influencing people. Mm -hmm. That and she's worried that we're going to get robbed, but I'm not worried about that too much in Canada. But she just doesn't want me influencing you guys because the amount of money that I have put into this room is ridiculous. ridiculous. And let's just put in perspective I could have bought my GMC Sierra truck. Easily. Easily. And that is like. Don't say well, what if you want and you want to go and look how much a GMC Sierra is pre-owned and or new? That is going to be your answer on how much this room is. Mm -hmm. Because again, she does not want me to say. But anyways, guys, that's about it for me, and I will see you guys later.